Good morning student I am Nimai Chand Panda addressing you and today's topic cell structure and function student before going today's topic we should remind you to subscribe our channel and press the bell icon for further notification now student today's topic cell structure and function what to be discussed first in today's topic the first discussion is what is cell cell is the basic structural functional unit of living organism in other words cell make up living things and carry out activity that keep a living things alive so student this is the definition of cell who dis- discovered the cell the cell first discovered by robert hooke in 1665 in cork he found honeycomb like structure under the microscope that microscope was cell invented by robert hooke that was empty and he gave the name cell here cell means small room which is kept which is used for keeping prisoner student first living cell observed by anton von leeuwenhoek in 1674 while studying pond water he found the first living cell is the spirogyra a algae so student this is the discovery of the cell and this is the meaning of the cell student cell theory came in existence in 1838 by two german scientists swan and slidell what are the statement of the cell theory the statement of the cell theory all living things are made up of one or more cell all living things arise all living cells arise from the pre-existing cell by division the cell is the basic unit of structure and function in all living organism so student this is the statement of the cell theory comes in existence in 1838 by swan and slidell student depending upon the number of the cell organism may be unicellular if the organism contain single cell then the organism is unicellular unicellular organism control their all activity by single cell example of unicellular organism euglena paramecium yeast yeast is the single cellular single cellular fungi paramecium is the protozoan and euglena also protozoan so these are the single cell animal those animal which carry out they are all living activity by means of single cell they are unicellular organism while others those who have the more than one cell in their body they are known as multicellular organism maximum of the plant animals and fungi they are of multicellular organism because they perform their all living activity in coordination of more than one cell multicellular organism perform their activity in coordination of the cell they have so these are multicellular organism what is the size of the cell the size of the cell vary some of the cell smaller very small maximum cell are small but some of the cell very small and some of the cell are large smallest cell is mycoplasma size 0.1 mm the largest cell is ostrich cell size 18 cm shape of the cell student the shape of the cell vary according to the function performed by the cell different cell perform different function there is a clear cut division of the labor among the cell in an organism cell perform the function the shape is related to the performing cell human rbc circular become biconcave for easy passage through human capillaries so that is the human rbc cell shape nerve cells are branched to conduct impulse from one point to another point so these are the branched long thread like structure nerve cell human rbc can change their shape to engulf the microorganism that enter the body muscle cell are spindle shaped so different function they carry out according to the function the shape is 
designing. Difference between the plant cell and animal cell. As you found, there is a two group, plant group and animal group. So there is a difference in the cell structure in plant cell, animal cell. In animal cell, generally cell are small in size, plant cell large in size. Cell wall is absent in animal cell, cell wall present in plant cell. Plastid are absent in animal cell, plastid are present in plant cell. Vacuoles are smaller in size and few in number in animal cell. But vacuoles are larger in size and more in number in plant cell. You can say the maximum portion of the plant cell occupied by the vacuole. Centioles are present in animal cell. Centioles are absent in plant cell. What is the structure of the cell? The structure of the cell is in eukaryotic cell, the cells have so many components. What are the components? Plasma membrane, nucleus and cytoplasm. Everything within the plasma membrane that is called as protoplasm. Nucleus is the center of the cell and cytoplasm is the fluid present between the plasma membrane and nucleus. Within cytoplasm, cytoplasm have the cell organelles. Cell organelles are membrane bound structure which perform different function in cell. In eukaryotic cell, different function performed by different organelles. What is this organelle? These are endoplasmic reticulum, Golgi body, lysosome, vacuoles, mitochondria, plastid, centrosome and cytoskeleton. So this is the structure of the cell. Cell organelles. Now the cell organelle, as I told you, in cell different functions performed by different cell organelle, and these functions are coordinated. We have to study the cell organelle one by one. Plasma membrane. Plasma membrane, the outer layer covering the cell is known as the plasma membrane. Plasma membrane present both in animal cell and plant cell. Extremely delicate, thin, elastic, long, living and semi-permeable membrane. What is the semi-permeable membrane? Semi-permeable membrane allows certain things to go inside and allows certain things to go outside. Semi-permeable does not allow everything to go outside, everything to go inside. Made up of two layers of lipid molecule in which protein molecules are floating. Thickness varies 75 to 110 Armstrong. Can be observed under electron microscope. What is the function of the plasma membrane? The function of the plasma membrane maintain shape and size of the cell, protect internal content of the cell, regulate entry and exit of substance and in and out of the cell, maintain homeostasis. Plasma membrane are such a design that it does not allow everything to go outside and it does not allow everything to go inside. So it is semi-permeable membrane. Cell wall. Cell wall found in plant cell. These are the rigid dead components. Non-living and outermost covering of the cell, plant and bacteria can be tough, rigid, sometimes flexible, made up of cellulose, hemicellulose, pectin, may be thin or thick, multi-layered structure. Thickness varies 50 to 1000 Armstrong. What is the function of the cell wall? The function of the cell wall provides definite shape, strength and rigidity, prevent drying up, desiccation of the cell, help in controlling cell expansion, protect cell from external pathogen. Nucleus. Nucleus is the center of the cell. It found generally at the center of the cell. It is dense spherical body located near the center of the cell. Diameter varies 10 to 25 millimicron. Present in all cell except some cell like red cell, red blood cell and sieve tube cell. Sieve tube cell found in the phloem of the plant. Depending upon the nucleus, the cells 
can be divided into two types prokaryotic eukaryotic those cells which do not have the developed nucleus covered by nuclear membrane they are prokaryotic cell like bacterial cell blue green algae cell and those cell which covered by new which which nucleus covered by nuclear membrane all developed nucleus are there they are eukaryotic cell plant cell animal cell they are eukaryotic cell as blue green algae and bacteria nucleus is not developed in this case that is prokaryotic cell most of the cells are uninucleated having one nucleus few type of cell have more than one nucleus like skeletal muscle cell nucleus covered by double membrane structure these are known as nuclear membrane nuclear membrane are porous these pores are signify to go certain thing inside and certain thing go outside there is a transfer of material between the cytoplasm and nucleus nucleoplasm contain the nucleolus and network of chromatin fiber nucleolus at the center of the nucleus fibers composed of deoxyribonucleic acid dna and protein these fiber contain to form chromosome during cell division nucleus nucleus here chromosome contain that chromosome contain stretches of dna these stretches of dna known as gene gene transfer the hereditary information from one generation to the next what is the function of the nucleus control the cell activity like metabolism protein synthesis growth and cell division nucleolus synthesize rna ribonucleic acid store hereditary information in the form of gene cytoplasm cytoplasm is the fluid present between the nucleus and plasma membrane this cytoplasm is contain 80% of the water this contains clear liquid portion called cytosol and it also hold certain organelles some of these organelles visible only under the electron microscope cytoplasm is the place of various biochemical reaction various biochemical reaction takes place in the cytoplasm and in the cytoplasm there is a so many cell organelles in eukaryotic cell embedded here it is noted that in prokaryotic cell there is no cell organelles cell organelles endoplasmic reticulum endoplasmic reticulum is a kind of cell organelle which are tube like structure this tube like structure extended throughout the cell and transfer material from one portion of the cell to other portion of the cell this endoplasmic reticulum are of two type rough endoplasmic reticulum and smooth endoplasmic reticulum rough endoplasmic reticulum are those endoplasmic reticulum which adhere ribosome over their membrane this endoplasmic reticulum synthesize protein this endoplasmic reticulum synthesize protein smooth endoplasmic reticulum are the endoplasmic reticulum who does not adhere ribosome over their membrane they synthesize lipid and smooth endoplasmic reticulum also detoxify drugs and poison this endoplasmic reticulum as it provide protein and lipid it play role in membrane biogenesis what is membrane biogenesis making of plasma membrane from the precursor so endoplasmic reticulum also is the important things for membrane biogenesis golgi body golgi body first discovered by camillo golgi in neuron cell formed by stack of five to eight membrane sac sacs are usually flattened and called cisternae has two end cis situated near the endoplasmic reticulum and trans faces situated near the cell membrane function of the golgi body 
modify sorts and packs material synthesized in the cell. Deliver synthesized material to various target inside the cell and outside the cell. Produce vacuole and secretory vesicle. Form plasma membrane and lysosome. Lysosome. Lysosome is a sac-like structure containing hydrolytic enzyme. These lysosomes perform to protect the cell. Whenever any pathogen enters into the cell, lysosome secrete hydrolytic enzyme and digest it. This lysosome also called as suicidal bag. Why it is suicidal bag? It is suicidal bag because these lysosomes blast when the cell is injured. These lysosomes blast when cell is injured and digest the cell and clear the environment. Vacuoles. Vacuoles are available in plant cell, animal cell. These are empty space. These are empty space used to store food, waste material and other. In plant cell, the maximum portion occupied by vacuole. Single membrane sac filled with liquid or sap. In animal cell, vacuoles are temporarily small in size, few in number. In plant cell, vacuoles large, more in number. May be contractile, non-contractile. Function of the vacuole. Fun store various substance including oil product. Maintain osmotic pressure of the cell. Store food particles in amoeba cell. Provide turgidity and rigidity to the plant cell. Mitochondria. Mitochondria known as powerhouse of the cell. This is double membrane structure. This is double membrane structure. But the inner membrane are folded inside the matrix of the mitochondria to form the finger-like projection known as cristae. Here energy produced. Functions of the mitochondria synthesize energy rich compound ATP. ATP molecule provide energy for the vital activity of the living cell. Mitochondria have their own DNA. As it have the own DNA, it signifies that during cell division, mitochondria divide and go to the progeny cell. Plastid. Plastid is the color body found in plant cell. No animal cell found plastid. Plastid have different type, chromoplastid, chloroplastid and leucoplastid. Depending on the presence of plastid, they are chromoplastid. Chromoplastid, all the plastid which responsible for color other than green color. Chloroplastid are the plastid which responsible for the green color of the leaf and leucoplastid are the plastid which are colorless. They store the food like protein, lipid and starch. Plastid also have their own DNA. So it is also signify that during cell division of the plant cell, these plastid divide and go to the progeny cell. Centrosome. Centrosome found in the animal cell. Centrosome is the membrane bound organelle present near the nucleus. Consists two structures called centriole. Centrioles are hollow cylindrical structure made of microtubule. Centrioles are arranged at right angle to each other. Function of the centriole. Form spindle fiber which help in the movement of chromosome during cell division. Help in the formation of cilia and flagella. Discussion for you. What to discuss? Discuss cell theory. Compare the size of largest and smallest cell. What is the difference between animal and plant cell? What are the functions of different cell organelle? Which cell organelle is referred to as powerhouse of the cell? So student, these are the question, these are the point of discussion for you. Thanks student, thank you for observing the video.